Hey guys, Johnny Cash here, and today I'm going to guys with the League on Showdown, otherwise known as LSD Pokemon League. Week 2 battle. In week 1, I kind of just got destroyed by a... By a Hall, but we don't talk about that anymore. This is week two. It's in the past. So, we face Psychedelic, and his Tornado Therion is supposed to be a High Dragon. They just didn't... Yeah. So, my team is Manaphy, Scizor, Whimsicott, Delphox, Hitmonchan, Cricktoon, Thunder's Therion, Ditto, Nidoking, Rhydon, Golduck, and Mega Charizard X. And his team is High Dragon... Diggers be Araconade, Reggie Steel, Absol, Wigglytuff, Gum O, Thunder Thunderous Incarnate, Whimsicott, Musharna, Needle Queen, and Mega Camerupt. My Z users are Manaphy, Thunderous Theory, and New King, while his Z users are Hydragon, Gum O, and Thunderous Incarnate. So this is a tough battle, but I w but yeah, we'll get, we're gonna push through it. So I'll see you at the battle. All right, so I am back. So, I'll just to quickly go over the team I brought. Brought Life Orb, Sheer Force, Needle King with Earth Power, Thunderbolt, Sludge Wave, and Ice Beam with enough speed for the not for his non-existent Needle Queen. A Banded Scizor with Bullet Punch, Super Power, U-Turn, and Knock Off. With 248 HP, 250 max attack, adamant, and 8 speed. I don't remember what the speed was for, but yeah. A Wakanberry Manaphy with Ice Beam, Surf, Tail Glow, and U-Turn. With enough speed for the hit for his non-existent Nino Queen. A Focus Sash Whimsicott with Defog, Moonblast, Encore, and Taunt. With max HP... 248 defense and 8 speed, which was, I believe, enough to outspeed his combo, but I'm not sure. A. My Mega Charizard X with Flare Blitz, Dragon Claw, Dragon Dance, and Thunder Punch with enough speed to outspeed, I think it was. It, his. Uh. I'll be right back. Alright, I have found out. It was enough speed for the... The speed on my Mega Charizard X was enough speed for the... Uh... For his non-existent Tornado Styrian. But... Playing safe. Then, finally... Psychium Z Thunderous. With Psychic Focus Blast, Nasty Plot, and Thunderbolt. With enough speed for his non-existent Neo Queen. This was basically the Neo Queen check. So yeah, he ends up bringing his Diggersby, which in Mox just completely ran through my team. High Dragon, his Mega, his Mega Camera, his Araquanid, his Thunderous Incarnate, and his Como. So yeah, in Mox the the Diggersby just ran through my team, and I and in Mo one Mox in particular, I had to face Trick Room, and at the end he just late game sweeped with Mega Camera up. But this is the real thing. So going into the match, let me just turn that off and zoom in. I am going to lead my Thunderous while he leads Mega Camera up. And I decide to to go for a nasty plot. I'm gonna put this back on normal. Well, he just gets up rocks, and I f decide to fire off my psychic UMZ, and it uh, one shots him. So that's really good. So he goes into his high dragon. I just stay in and go for a focus blast. He is scarfed, I think. Wait, no, he's not scarfed. He just outspeeds. And he doesn't kill, and I kill him with a Focus Blast. So that's two kills right off the bat. And he decides to, to just revenge kill me with a Hidden Power. That was Hidden... And you'll see later that... I'll tell you what type it is later, but... I just decide to get rocks off the field, and he goes for Hidden Power. 
super effective on this, but not su but not very effective on Thunder Styrian. It was Hidden Power Flying. So stab Hidden Power load. I decide to go into my Mega Charizard, and I decide and I decide to and he's gonna wait. He's gonna Thunder Wave me because he has Prankster. I get my Dragon Dance up, and goes for Hidden Power Flying. I take that and I just body him with. Dragon Claw. He goes into Coma O. I decide to go into Scizor, which was my only switch in. He goes for Clank Scales. Doesn't he doesn't really do much. And this bullet punch is just gonna body this Diggers Bee. And I was so you don't understand how happy I was when that Diggers Bee went down. But anyway, I'm just gonna bullet punch this. He brings out the Coma O. I'm going to bullet punch it, and he's gonna, just going to kill me with flamethrower. So, I decide to go into Manaphy, and I think I set up a tail glow. Ah, oh, dang it. Well, sorry about that. I set up a tail glow. And, a, and turns out he has water absorb infestation. So, great. Here, I just decide to U-turn out. And go into my Mega Charizard. He tries to toxic me. Infestation toxic. That's some tech. And I'm gonna Dragon Claw. He is Haban and he's Habanberry. Uh, Coma O. And I'm just gonna let my Charizard go down to claiming scales. That gives me a switch into my Neo King. And I go for the Sludge Wave, kill him. And this Thunderbolt is just he's Wakanberry. So, Wakanberry vs. Wakanberry. And he has Miracle. The, the last Thunderbolt didn't kill, but... He, but... And he kills me with Miracle, but I just go into Manaphy and U-turn, kill him, kill him, and that's the game. So, GG to Psychedelic. That was honest... That match was honestly really scary. Thunderous putting in work. Mega Charizard putting in work. Manaphy definitely putting in work. And Scizor. All of everyone put in work. Except for maybe the cotton. The women's cotton. But that put in work last. That almost put in work last week. So yeah. That dang it. 5%. So I have to end this fast. Oh great. Oh great. This, is, this ending is just not going well for me. So. Yeah. That was. The LSD League. Week 2. GG to Psychedelic. And I'm probably, and next week I'm probably gonna do a team builder. So, yeah. Alright, with that said, I'll see you guys next time. Be sure to like, subscribe, and with that said, see ya. Bye bye.